Welcome to my channel, channel of Emmanuel Author. Today I would like to discuss a book um, which I found before the Christmas in the internet. Uh, the title is uh, Aunt Sass, the author is uh, Pamela Lyndon Travers. And this is a book for children and teenagers, but uh, I like the cover of this book and the description. I bought it and I'm very positively surprised. This is a collection of three uh, short stories Aunt Sass, um, Agvong, and Johnny Delaney. And these two, um, these three stories are very interesting. Uh, the stories Agvong and Johnny Delaney, these are the stories which uh, which are about uh, two men, two personality, uh, who took care about um, uh, the narrator of this book in her childhood. And um, but I would like uh, today focus uh, only uh, on the um, story Aunt Sass uh, because I would like that you would read uh, all the book. So, uh, the heroine of this uh, short story is Aunt Sass, um, and this is Christina Saraset, which lived uh, 94 years, and this is he. She is a great aunt of the narrator of this book, and she is presented by the through the eyes of uh, the narrator. The author of this book, Pamela Rindon Travers, used her very interesting method characters construction. Uh, she uh, show uh, the um, heroine through the prism of her uh, character, but it is uh, not good character. Uh, this Christina Saraset is uh, presented as a person uh, angry angry, who um, answer rudely, who is uh, close to, to the others, who reject uh, the ideas of the children, who criticize children, who gossip, who complains, who uh, is uh, not uh, nice to the others and who reject the help, uh, but uh, then she gives a check, uh, she help. And Christina Saraset has love uh, inside, indeed, but she can't uh, to show this emotion, can't to be um, very uh, warm person. And on the end of this book, she changed totally from a person uh, not so happy uh, in the life to a person who is totally glad uh, from the bitter life to a happy one uh, and um, I don't want to reveal uh, the end uh, so strong uh, because I um, I would like to, that you will read um, this book but you may ask uh, why should I read uh, the book for children and teenager so um, this book is very very short so uh, one can read it very quickly and the language of this book is uh, flowery and um, the structure uh, is more or less uh, thoughtful uh, and I read this book really with great great pleasure and 
I think that this book is for us as a alarm bell because uh, sometimes uh, also in our life we can't show our emotion, our love to the other people uh, sometimes because we are blocked um, and um, I'm uh, interested in uh, what do you think about this uh, uh, subject uh, if it's uh, really easy to show our love to the others and we um, do it of it is uh, too um, too hard to to do it, and we try to avoid it. We can um, change our life having uh, 94 years, but the question is if it is uh, not too late to if it's maybe better to start uh, live now to change something in our life to show the uh, our good emotion to the others. So. Mm, write me your opinion in the comments what do you think uh, about it and uh, feel free to subscribe to this channel and uh, to like this video and I invite you to visit my website with which will be um, soon translated into English and thank you for watching see you